Hey guys, so excuse my look first of all. I just wanted to pop in here really quick, stopped what I was doing before I upload this video. Um, just because I'd be remiss if I didn't address what is going on in the world today. I, I literally, I, I don't even have the words because as I am posting this video, I've learned of another man, Richard Brooks, um, another black man, Richard Brooks, who was killed at the hands of the police in Atlanta, Georgia. And, you know, I feel like, and I, I, I am so, so passionate and I'm so immersed in this movement right now and I urge you guys to take action. I urge you guys to join me in standing against racism. I join you guys to support and donate, donate, donate if you can. Um, and, and, and take the time to amplify black voices. And so you guys see this content playing out. I have been posting videos, old videos that I haven't gotten around to posting just because I, I, before all of this, you know, started, I wanted to get back to a rhythm of posting content. But like I said, I cannot not address what's going on and let you guys know where I stand. I 100% stand behind the Black Lives Matter movement and I, urge you guys to join me um, and, and get educated and use your voice and use your platform if you have one. You know, speak to your family members, speak to your loved ones. We all need to get on the right side of this movement because this cannot continue on. Um, and so I just wanted to put that out there and now let's get into the video. Um, this is kind of like a mashup vlog. It's just all of the activities, all the quarantine activities that I've been up to. Uh, since we're still in quarantine here in New York. And you guys will see more content coming in the next few weeks. My arm is starting to hurt. What was I gonna say? You guys will see, I'm posting every Wednesday, Friday, and Sunday, so definitely stay tuned. I'm gonna be posting a lot more videos. There's a new hair update coming soon, which is why I have it covered. Check the links down below for resources and organizations that I'm personally donating to, and I would encourage you guys to do the same. And I will see you guys in the next video. Bye guys. Absolutely insane. There is no toilet paper anywhere. What did we get? For those of you guys that are living under a rock, sorry, um, then you know that we are self-quarantined here in New York. Um, COVID-19, aka coronavirus, is forcing us all to stay inside. And so I am going to be working from home for the foreseeable future. For a second, I thought I was going to stop all content altogether because I just thought, you know, it seems so insensitive. It's like there's other things that we should be worried about and talking about with this, you know, pandemic. But I decided ultimately that, you know, also during these scary times, 
I personally don't want to be watching the news or hearing all of this like crazy scary negative stuff 24-7 um, you know this is a perfect time to work on yourself and read a book and you know work on something that you've been wanting to work on for a long time or something that you've been putting off for a long time work on your fitness work on reflection and you know work on creating things that bring you joy and consuming content that brings you joy and so that is why I decided I'm gonna pick up the vlog cam and get back to creating content creating videos and things that hopefully um, take your mind off of this crazy thing that we're all living through if even for just a few minutes a day here we are I it's like way too late to say anything good afternoon good morning it's 4 15 right now and I woke up uh, Raul made us some pancakes which were delicious um, I did a little workout on the Peloton bike. Another thing that I want to talk to you guys about, we did go grocery shopping. The grocery store situation here in New York is absolutely insane. There is no toilet paper anywhere. Um, luckily, we did find toilet paper in our neighborhood. But um, we stocked up on all the groceries because we're going to obviously be staying home and not eating out or ordering takeout just for safety. Um, you know. I have older parents, Raul has older parents, and so we have them in mind when we, we we were thinking about them when we decided that we're just gonna stay home and not go out and socialize. Um, and like my grandparents, you know, it's just like it's, we also have like newborn nieces, so it's just, it's just for everyone's safety. And I think that, you know, to each their own, but I strongly, strongly encourage you guys to just stay home during these times. Um, just for not just for your safety I get it like maybe you're really fit and strong and you have a great immune system but for other people that you come in contact with with that being said we stocked up on all of the groceries and we've been cooking and making all of our meals at home before this all broke out I had already ordered freshly um, which is a meal subscription service this is not sponsored at all but it's a meal subscription service of like pretty healthy clean meals I had placed my order for my for my delivery um, Again, like way before this even was a thought in my mind that this would happen, which which just works out perfectly now because Raul and I have not just the groceries that we bought, but then if we don't feel like cooking, we also have the option of having our prepared meals that we just have to microwave. What did we get? Sausage baked penne, cauliflower shell bolognese, Sicilian style chicken parm, chicken teriyaki, Mexican style shredded beef, and almond chicken, wait, almond ginger chicken bowl. wanted to check in and say good night sign off for the night um today was a little bit uneventful it was like a true sunday a lot of like watching the news there's a lot of stuff you know happening in new york they officially closed down schools which is a good thing i think um to kind of contain this crazy aggressive virus so yeah a lot of that I made delicious chili for dinner and i made a huge pot so that we have leftovers um I did not film the video that I intended to just because I kind of have a little bit of a headache. 
and then as a true hypochondriac, I was looking up corona virus symptoms, um, but turns out I don't have corona, it's just allergies. So yeah, I have my cup of tea, and this book that I'm about to start reading, let me show you guys. I'm actually going to start reading this book, You're Not Lost. One of my good friends, Miriam, recommended this book, so I'm going to dive into this. Um, it's actually like 11, and I should be asleep by now. I'm going to read a couple pages of this, and knock out, call it a night, and I figure I'll continue vlogging tomorrow. It's going to be like my first Monday working from home, so I'll take you guys along with me and show you my little setup and my, you know, day-to-day, -day, um, which is like now my new norm, working from home. So yeah, I will see you guys tomorrow. Just being nothing else 
Tag auf 